Hey all and welcome to another guitar build update. Obviously and unfortunately I fell behind with the regular updates and have done way too much stuff to cover in a timely fashion, so instead of going over what's been done, I'm just going to catch you all up to where I am right now and move on from there. When you last saw this guitar, I had just finished getting the neck pocket chiseled out and gotten the neck break angle about where it needed to be. The guitar is now sanded and ready for finishing, which means that both pickups and rear control cavities have been chiseled out, the post holes for the bridge and tailpiece are drilled along with channels through the body for the electronics. I made a rear plate cover out of some excess mahogany, reshaped the headstock to look a little bit less, you know, Gibson-y, and prepped the body for finishing before finally gluing in the neck and filling in various gaps in the body from difficulties during the sawing and pocket carving. Now, I had previously finished sanded the entire body except for the front through 80, 100, 120, 150, and 220 grits, which was a bit presumptuous on my part. Various stains and dents from crap on my bench built up and it needed to be redone, so I did the front with 80 and 100, and then from 120 up to 220, I did the back and sides as well as the front before finishing off the really old 220 disc that was probably closer to 300 or so due to wear. With all that done, I covered the fretboard with masking tape since I really don't want any of what I'm about to do to wind up on it. Now I wipe the whole thing down with a tack cloth to get any dirt, dust, etc. off, and finally the woodworking money shot. Oil. I rubbed in a pretty liberal amount of Danish oil with 80 grit wet dry sandpaper. See, the dust made by the sanding mixes with the oil and makes a slurry that gets into the pores and helps seal the wood, making the clear coat go on more smoothly. I left that to sit for a day and then did the whole thing again with 2000 grit this time. This build is getting down to the wire, so the next update will be lacquering, smoothing, installing the hardware, and doing all the wiring. After that, I think it'll be uh, strings and retrospective time. So, uh, thanks for watching. Cheers.